Obviously, this is, this is built with Flash. Now, that's really cool, but when you're playing these games, we were thinking about this, and we thought, why isn't it possible to actually use game controllers to play games? Why do you have to use your mouse and your keyboard? Well, you can do that now. So, uh, we're working on game controller support for Flash, so let me just keep playing that game with this controller. Look at that. We just plugged an Xbox controller into my computer and have to keep playing the game. So, controller support for Flash is coming. Uh, we're working on it right now. You'll be able to use an array of different controllers as you're building your gaming experiences. And that's going to enable all kinds of new uh, possibilities as you're, as you're building your games. Great game controller. Now, we aren't stopping there. We're also thinking about how we can move expressiveness for games forward. And a lot of games, of course, are, are using 3D now. Uh, we just looked at a couple of 2D games, but 3D is starting to be used more. And we've had 3D inside of Flash for a while now. Um, we've had support in there. And the community actually has been building uh, some 3D frameworks on top of the support we have in there. So like Alternativa 3D, for example, Paper Vision. Uh, there's a lot of great frameworks out there. So we've been looking at how we can advance this 3D technology. And we've got a, an example of a game that we put together here called Max Racer. And Max Racer, wow. does that look pretty cool? Look at that car. All right. I can spin this car around. Wow. It's got some nice reflections happening on the car here. Wow, uh, this car is really cool. Look at that. All kinds of different shades if I want. I'll go Adobe Red. Okay. Um, and now I've got this great car. So now many of you may be familiar with some of the 3D work uh, that we've done in Flash already. And how much CPU do you think it's taking to render this car right now? 20%? How much do you think? Somebody yell something out. Five hundred percent. Okay. One hundred percent. Let's take a look. So here I have task manager. Quayon, Quayon. There's Flash Player. It's zero percent. Oh, wait, let me spin wow. this. Oh, how do you go through Zero percent. Sometimes it's one percent. <laughs> so this is taking full advantage of how GPU how inside how the machine here to do fully hardware accelerated GPU rendering of 3D graphics inside Flash Player. Wow. Nata, <laughs> nata. And this is um, taking advantage of both OpenGL and DirectX, and also we have software rendering capabilities if you, if you need to do that as well. More so let me go into the game here, uh, type my name, and uh, we've got a multiplayer version or a single player. I'm going to go single player, and let me go full screen as well. Okay. Full screen. There we go. All right, nice full screen world. Now, um, let's look around here. So I can do a little camera move, so we can look around. And look at the rendering of this world. This is actually the LA Convention Center. Um, we're going to be racing around that shortly. But look at the quality of that rendering. Beautiful, beautiful rendering. So thanks to, to the Alternativa guys who have been working with us on this, as well as Mythos Labs to help us build a game engine on top of this new technology we're working on. Now, I can race this car around, of course, with my keyboard. I've got brakes and arrows and things like that I can do here. Now, we've got game controller support coming, so why am I going to use my keyboard? Why don't I use a game controller for driving? So, we actually have one connected up here. A steering wheel. So, I've got a ah. USB steering wheel from Logitech that we've hooked up to the computer here. And some uh, pedals down here I can use to actually drive the car. Though I'm standing up, so it's kind of like driving a UPS truck or something, but I'll do my best. <laughs> All right, so here I am racing the car around the track here. And you can see I can make some good corners there. Oh, there's a ramp. Okay. Go for it. <laughs> wow, <laughs> so I can corner and do brakes, slam into the wall there. So this is a great, a great fun 3D game that's being built here uh, with the 3D technology that's coming uh, with Flash Player. And you're going to be able to play with this yourself. Uh, we're going to have this installed in our booth in the expo hall. You can start driving the car around and see what it's like.